everybody, welcome back to Bobble Pop Kids. I promised it and here we go. My part two of the Dollar Tree Back to School Bonanza. So many things. I think there's actually more in this one than the first. Tons and tons of pens, the cutest little school supplies. Let's look at them. We're gonna be starting with the notebooks. I found two notebooks for this haul. They are so adorable. Look at this one. It says friends, BFF, LOL. It's got the cutest colors on there. And it's a composition book, which is perfect for like doing your homework. You can use this in school. I also found the gold one. I found the golden notebook. Would you look at this, you guys? It is so pretty. It's just so amazing looking. And the best part about it, it's not the kind that has all the glitter falling off everywhere, making a mess. It's just right in the paper there. And it's also perfect line for doing your homework. You could use one of these for like English, one for social studies, whatever class you like and we also got more of these little pocket buddies last time i got like a little teddy bear this time there is a frog <laughs> and like i said they're so so babyish looking but they're just too too darn cute i love them Yay. here we go here's a close-up look at these they have all these cute little polka dots you could pop them right in one of your binders you can just keep them like this put them in your backpack so we got those on to some pens and boom here we go look at all of the pens you guys <laughs> i have a whole load of highlighters and different pencils to show you these are just the pens i found we have one two three four five six seven eight different little packs here let's look at them one by one you can start with these here they're called pen with comfort grip and would you look at these cool prints on here i just couldn't believe they were a dollar i've never seen anything like this at the dollar tree they are just so cool looking and we get four different ones this one is like a turquoise we get a purple with some pink i don't know kind of looks like a giraffe print <laughs> we get a pink one and a green i wonder what color they write in we could test them in our BFF notebook and look at this. <laughs> the colors match perfectly. They go so good with this notebook. See, I actually hope they're black or blue ink so you could use them at school. Nope, it is purple. And for the second one here, and another thing that I love about these is this grip here. It's so big and rubbery, really, really comfy to write with. Oop, and it's a pretty hot pink color. Ooh, these are smooth writing. Here is the turquoise one, turquoise of course, and for this green. Yep, so we get four different colors, kind of like neons, I love these. It's always good to have different color pens with you if you're doing some correcting or editing. So I found these two pack of chunkies. Look at these pens, they're kind of short and they're a little chubby looking. Look at them, they have hearts. This one has different little sayings on it. These are adorable. <laughs> I've never seen pens in a shape like this. They're so, so funny looking. So here we go. This is the first. It's got all these funny sayings. It says, really, cool, classmates, drama queen. Ooh, how do you open it? Ooh, you just twist it. I thought it was like a clicker one. That's kind of cool. So you just spin the top. And this one has all of these hearts with like pastel colors. They are such pretty prints. I cannot believe both of these were just a dollar. Test these ones too. I'm pretty sure these are black ink. Oh yeah, they're black. Perfect for doing your homework or school assignments. So is this one. And one thing I am super obsessed about with these Dollar Tree pens, they write so smooth. There is no difference from these or like the $10 pens. They write super good. Up. I got these funky ones. Look at these. They are so cool looking. This one is white with these little triangles. It kind of reminds me of candy. I don't know why. I love these little swirlies on there. These are the exact same pen. I had to get both packs except they're pink with little white polka dots. They are so girly and cute. So we got black ink for both of these, which is perfect. We haven't gotten any blue inks yet. All right, so we're going to open these and take a closer look. a little more than the pink. They're just really cool looking. So we get three of those and three of these ones. 
Here they are, all mixed together. These little swirly tip pens, I love them. They were, what were they, six for two dollars. That is amazing. You're not getting sick of pens, because they just keep coming along. So I found these ones, they are kind of cool. They have that rubber grip, and what color are they? I think they're all different colors, actually. It says comfort grip, retractable, ultra low viscosity, and glue. Sounds fancy. And here they are. Ooh, these are probably the most comfortable ones. They have like the perfect shape. <gasps> Love them. I've seen these in other stores. Each one could be like two or three dollars. So you get three for a dollar. Let's test out the color. Here's the pink. See? Ooh, and it's a hot pink. What a pretty color. <laughs> that is so cool. It's kind of like the other pink, just a little bit darker. And we have the green. Lime green, and I'm sure the purple one is gonna write in purple. Ooh, these are cool. So smooth writing. So we get some more colored pens. Now these next ones blew me away. When I saw them, they look like jeans. They're called Dazzling Denim Ballpoint Pens. They have this little denim print on there. How stylish is that? I've never seen anything like this. So we get eight of them and they're all black ink. They have different patterns on here. Some of them are like a lighter denim. They just match with your jeans. Here's a darker wash. And I love how they have that yellow stitching just like on your jean pocket. Here's some more lighter ones. This is kind of like, I don't know, like a summery jean. Actually, these are the first pens that have caps that come on and off. The rest of them are like those clicker ones, so they're kind of different to add to your collection for school. Yep, they're black writing, really, really smooth. We are just loaded to the gills with pens today. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen so many pens at one time. Alrighty, so we have two more packs of pens, and then we're moving on to the pencils. <laughs> So these are the last ones. We get an eight pack of all different colors. Ooh, I love these. We get like orange, blue, purple, pink, black, green, all of the colors. And we also get these, which I also think are different colored inks too. They kind of look like candy canes, these ones. Let's we'll start with this pack first. Oh yeah, and here are all the colors they write with. These are actually good for like doodling and when you're making pictures in class and Make them little flowers and stuff. They give you all the colors you need. And I love the shape of these. They're kind of thin. The cap is clear, a little bit different looking. These are cute. And I love that we get an orange one. Look how bright it is. Alrighty, so it's time to test out these colorful pens. And I looked at the tip. They have such a strange tip. They're not like a regular ballpoint. Kind of strange. There's the orange color, super bright. Not as bright as the actual pen. But another thing I love about these is they're just like a really, really fine tip. So you can write so nice and neat with these. Here's the purple one. Oh, I love them. These are even good for doing homework just because they're such a fine tip. Here's the red. We get two different blues. One of them is like a lighter, like a turquoise. And here is the green. That's a really pretty one. We're coming on to the pink. Ooh, I like that. And a regular black one. So all together we get eight different colors. These pens are so amazing. I wish you could just see how they write. They're called Fashion Sticks and I got eight of them for a buck. Moving on from the Fashion Sticks, we're going to this six pack. Ooh, these are fine tip as well. And the thing that struck me with these, they kind of look like little candy canes with stripes. They are so, so cute looking. Open them. There we go, six more. And they're almost the same exact colors. The other set had two more. And these look really, really fine tipped as well. Ooh. Here's the tip and you can see how fine it is. Ooh, this writes so, so smooth. It's kind of like writing with a really, really fancy, expensive pen. And <laughs> you would never know that these are from the Dollar Tree. And we get the purple one. The 
pretty much the same exact colors as the last, but they write a little bit easier. They're just kind of thinner pointed. These are a little bit thicker. We have every single kind of pet on the planet going on here. <laughs> so many different ones. Woo! Here they all are. So many different ones. Some are black, some are blue, some write with rainbow colors. And I love every single one of them. I don't think you're going to bring all of them to school in your pencil case. I mean, you could if you wanted to. You could share them with your friends or just show them your collection. You can keep some in your locker, keep some at home on your desk. You could do whatever you want with them. But I think all of these pens, I don't think this costed more than $8. <laughs> it was such a good deal. And all together, we have one, two, three, four, five. All together, we have 37 pens. So that's 37 pens for $8. What an amazing deal. And I even did some pens on my other Dollar Tree Bonanza. So I think I have like maybe a hundred pens all together. We're moving on to the pencils. Here we go. And I actually didn't find as many pencils as I did pens, but I found really, really cute ones. Look at these, they're the mechanical ones. Ooh, you can even refill them. They have comfort grip. And looking at this, it matches a couple notebooks that I got from the Dollar Tree. It's the same print with the star. And this one matches a little black notebook. So cool. I also got these. These are the coolest. They look like they're regular pencils, but they're mechanical ones. They have the prettiest little prints on there. Look at those butterflies and flowers. I found a couple packs of regular pencils that you sharpen. Those are my favorite. I like the mechanical ones. They're so much easier. But these were just too, too cute to pass up. Look at these. We have all these cute little polka dots. Then we have these blue ones with flowers. Sparkle ones, holographic, and these ones are just as cute. Look at these butterflies. We get this purple, these sparkly pink ones. So there's 12 for a dollar. So both of these cost a two dollars, a dollar, a dollar, a dollar. All together, I spent five dollars on pencils, and I think there's probably like 50 pencils here. These ones are also mechanical, and they are so 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 cute. Let's open them. We could start with these. They're called Ink Couture <laughs> because they have those amazing prints on there. Ah, here we go. And here they are. And I love the comfort grip on there. This one has kind of like, I don't know what this is. It looks like a zebra or a horse. Oh, it's a unicorn. How cute is that? Then we have this one here with all these cute little sayings, which matches this notebook. Identical. Look at that. It's the same exact print. There's this cute blue and purple one with all these pretty butterflies. And finally, ooh, this is probably my favorite. This pink with all of these stars. And on my last Dollar Tree Bonanza, I got this notebook. It matches it perfectly. Moving along to some more mechanical ones. And these are kind of cute. They're kind of tricky. They look like the regular pencils that you sharpen. But they're not. You just click them. They are such a cute size. They're a little shorter than a real pencil. <gasps> I love that butterfly. Look at that. So, so cute. You just click them just like that. You get this print. Really modern and pretty. Get some pink sunflowers. Ooh, I like this one. I think I have a beach towel that looks exactly like this. I love that blue and white. Ooh, we get two of those butterfly ones. And some more flowers. Really, really like these. Here's our regular old-fashioned pencils with a twist. Just because they have these pretty cute designs on them. So I am just amazed that there were 12 for a dollar. That is so cool. Another cute thing you could do with these, like if you're having a birthday party, you can put them in little gift bags. There's so many different ones. We get this purple one. I love this pink sparkly. This one here with the butterflies. That is really, really nice. And for the second pack of our old fashioned pencils. Ooh, these are probably my favorite design of all of them. Look at it. It looks like little birthday sprinkles. They are so, so pretty looking. So, let's dump them. We get 12 more to add to the collection. Look at that, how pretty. You could share them with your friends so you all have the same pencil. And I think just these pencils alone will probably last the whole year. <laughs> Forget all the other ones we're adding to them. We have all these. And our final pack is this four pack of mechanical ones. They are so, so bright. 
This one looks like it's tie dyeing. that print. We get this one here. It's like light purple. This is probably my favorite <laughs> just because of all of the colors. These two I think are my faves in all of the pencils. And then we get this one with all different colored flowers. Total on these we got 37 pencils for only five dollars. I don't know any other store in the world where you can get so much for such a little price. Moving on to some erasers. Eraser time! You can't do all that writing without some erasers for them. Now this one is kind of like the green one I had on my other shelf, but this is pink. It says for big mistakes. It is super heavy, so cute to look at. It's a size of probably 10 regular erasers. I love it. Jumbo erasers out of the package, and I love how it's that classic old-fashioned pink color. Just so, so funny looking. It's so hysterical if your friend asked you for an eraser and you like gave this to them. <laughs> They'd be like, what is this? It's so, so cool. We also got another six pack of erasers. Now look at the size of these compared to this. This is bigger than like all six of them together. So we get rainbow colors. They're super cute. These are more practical for putting in your pencil case. I think this one I would probably leave at home on my desk. But these are good for traveling. Ooh, and I love all of these bright neons. We get your plastic pink bubblegum color. Ooh, I like this neon orange. We get the red, green, yellow, and blue. Can't go wrong. Six erasers for a buck. And to add a little fun to your pencil case, I found these. These are also kind of babyish. They almost look like they're for preschool, but they are so, so cute. I love them. We get a little puppy, a lion. Look at that hippo. There we go. We get the lion. This purple hippo. Oh, I like this little turtle floating around. This one is a blue Ellie and a puppy. These are also cute if you're having like a party at school and you want to put things in gift bags. You can put a pencil and an eraser. They're so inexpensive. Here, there's 12 erasers for a dollar. The final pack of erasers I'm going to show you before we move it to the pencil cases. And we get four pack of erasers and four pencil sharpeners, which is super cool because you're gonna need one of those for all the pencils you have. This was only a dollar, I couldn't even believe it. And they have different colors, but I just went for this bright orange. It was just so cute. <laughs> I usually pick out pink and purple, but I went for orange this time. Well, school tools are exactly the same shape as these, a little bit bigger. And you get your matching little pencil sharpener. These are great to pass out to your friends too on the first day of school so you all have like matching supplies. Perfect. So here's my Dollar Tree erasers. And on all of these, I spent one, two, three, four dollars. I got tons and tons. This will probably last you like two years. How can you have all that school stuff without somewhere to put them? So I found some pencil cases. Last time I got these really cute star ones. This time I found this neat looking box. It's got butterflies on there, so, so cute. It kind of slides out like this. You can't put so many in there, but you could just put the basics. You could put a couple pens and pencils, scatter some erasers in there, a little pencil sharpener. It really does fit enough to get you through the day. You could just put one of everything. Slides back in, it's got this cute little button. I also found a binder one with Disney Princess. I love this, it's clear, it's so, so cute. This also could go as like a makeup case. You could put your lip glosses and stuff in here and put it in your binder. But I think I would use it for pencils. So, so pretty. Let's see what fits in this baby. Oh, it's so cute. It's got my favorite Cinderella in the middle. And I love keeping a pencil case in your binder. It just looks so cute. You have everything handy. You can keep it all organized. So we can put pencils in here. Ooh, these look like princess pencils. <laughs> they have those pink colors. We can put these little squiggly ones. Maybe some of the denim couple of these. These are really cute. They look like a giraffe print. I don't know. All different colors. We can put that big one in there. One of these. Just fits so, so much. 
I also found these. They are some locker magnets. How cute are they? When I first saw them, I just thought they were little stickers to like decorate your textbooks and stuff. But then I realized they were super thick and I saw they were magnets. How funny. Look at this little kitty with glasses, a little chihuahua. I love nerds. <laughs> oh, it's got a pug. That is like my favorite dog in the world. So you can just pop these on the inside of your locker. You're gonna look so, so cool with them. And they just like pop out like this. Wow, they're so, so bright. Super fine. All of these were just a dollar. Here's our little adorable locker magnets. I am in love with these. Look at these cute puppies. <laughs> they just melt my heart. Nothing is cuter than a little puppy with some sunglasses on. Those will cheer up your day. Another very important supply to keep with you are the highlighters. And I found two packs. These are your old regular yellow ones, but I love them just because they're super bright and kind of big to write with. I also found these with really cute patterns. Let's open it. On my last haul, I had really, really pretty ones. These ones are a little different. This looks like little balls of Play-Doh. <laughs> I don't know what that is supposed to be. It's colorful, it's cute. Ooh, it's a classic yellow one. Really bright. This one just has like little stripes going. Ooh, and it's blue. I love different color highlighters. I don't just like the yellow ones. And we get this one here with kind of a chevron print. And it is pink. Of course you get your regular Restoladores. <laughs> I guess that maybe that means highlighter in Spanish. I'm not too sure. But I do know that these are really good. These are just the classic ones. They've been around forever. Really, really smooth. So you're all set for your highlighters when you want to do some studying and highlight things. And this haul just keeps going and going. It's never going to end. I found so many things. I could literally stay in the Dollar Tree school, back to school department all day. They have so many things, so many cute finds. I could just stay there. So we found some magnetic clips. I don't know what they mean. Oh, magnetic. They must stick to the refrigerator. You can hang a picture on there. They're really, really cute looking. Yep, here we go. So you just put them on your fridge or your locker because those are usually metal. And you can hang a paper from there, maybe like a test or a calendar or something. Such a pretty design on there. So you get six of those for a buck. They're really different looking. And I also found an eight pack of glue sticks for a dollar. <laughs> glue sticks throughout the year. You always need them for something. So I think this will pretty much hold you over for the entire year or at least a semester. Get eight of them. These for sure are not the brand like Elmer's one, but I, I'm pretty sure they're going to be exactly the same because from what I've noticed, Dollar Tree has really good quality products and you cannot find a better deal for glue than that. <laughs> and we made it through our Dollar Tree Bonanza Part 2 back to school haul. Here are the last two items I found and they're really good. This one is a little Rapunzel notebook. I'm not sure if it has lines, but it's like a hologram. So, so pretty. That would go really cute inside of your princess pencil case. Take a look. Here it is, and on the inside, look at that. Each page has like a picture, a very light image of Rapunzel. You could color it in, or you could just write your friend's notes on top of these. You wouldn't exactly do any schoolwork in this, but it's such a cute little thing to carry in your backpack. I also found an eight pack of permanent markers, and these are so cool, they're exactly like Sharpies, and I'm sure they write just as good. Eight of them for a dollar. We get all your classic colors. We get black, yellow, green. Ooh, we even get a brown, red, purple, orange, and blue. Tested a couple of these Sharpies out on this Rapunzel paper. They're not the Sharpie brand, but they write exactly like that. Perfect to keep 
keep in your locker when you have to do some posters or kind of art projects. Really good one. Alrighty everybody, so there it is, my Dollar Tree haul number two. Dollar Tree is the best place to get your school supplies. So inexpensive, they have the cutest little things ever. And, and a lot of you guys are always asking me, what do you do with all this stuff? This stuff in particular, since I'm not going back to school, I actually finished school. <laughs> I'm all done with it. I do not need these back to school supplies. I'm gonna drop them off at like a local charity near my house, just so they can give them to some little girls who are in need of all of these cute little things for going back to school. Some of them can't afford them, and I think they would love, love, love to have these. So just in case you were wondering what I do, I like to give them away. <laughs> And we are gonna have so many more fun videos coming up on the show. This is Bubble Pop Kids. You can click this big red subscribe button here and subscribe to our channel. Have a great day, bye.